Hi, Kati. Um, Hungary does not take part regularly in the Eurovision Song Contest, but uh, this year it's one of the favorites. Uh, what do you think, say about this? I'm very happy of it because it means that people like the song and it's important because it's the contest of the songs mm -hmm. but it gives a pressure on my shoulder because I have to be very very good because people uh, await that from me. So we saw you yesterday on stage for the first time. How happy are you with, you, with the performance? Mm -hmm. Uh, I felt very good and I think the rehearsal, my, uh, our first rehearsal was uh, good and uh, mm -hmm. uh, the circumstances were, uh, were very good mm -hmm. and uh, um, we have to practice more mm -hmm. to show our best and to, uh, to do it uh, so the whole group has yeah. to be uh, a little bit ener more ener energized, yeah. energy, yeah. energetic, yeah. yes. but I think for the first rehearsal it was very good. Mm -hmm. You have quite a dance song, which is mm -hmm. no ballad and, and uh, <laughs> at all, uh, but with a nice uh, catchy tune and re mm -hmm. really easy to remember for many mm -hmm. people and all the fan clubs already treat you mm -hmm. as one of the favorites. Do you think in this year where the majority are not ballads, more, more faster songs, rock songs, this will uh, really f uh, mm -hmm. strike out the others? Mm -hmm. You know, I think it's uh, you. You never know what people like, uh, and uh, I love my song. And um, when um, <coughs> when we recorded it, the composers and I, I love the song, and we thought that it could be a, a famous pop song. Mm -hmm. But you never know what the audience say. They like it or they not. It uh, depends on. Now I, I have to focus on the three minutes on stage in. May uh, th 10th of May. Yeah. Uh, I hope it means something that people now people love love. What about my dreams? If you would win, how uh, would it be and what does it mean for Hungary? Mm -hmm. First of all, I have to do in s the best in uh, semi-final. Yeah. This is the next uh, uh, step. Yeah. Yeah. And after semi-final, we can talk again mm. <laughs> what we... Sometimes uh, they call it... Um, Kate Ryan phenomenon because uh, Kate Ryan once uh, was one of the favorites in the semifinals and then she did not pass mm -hmm. and she was very very disappointed. Mm -hmm. uh, how would you react if such uh, such thing would happen to you? Yes, of course I would be very mm -hmm. uh, sad if it happens, but um, I think I um, if I can sing the way I know I can and if I if I'm not uh, if I'm satisfied with myself and with my job mm -hmm. then. Um, then uh, uh, I won't be that sad. If I'm, if I, if I think, if I feel that I'm not that good on, on stage, yeah. then whatever happens, I'll be sad. Mm. But of course, I was. I, I have to go to. I I want to go to the final. <laughs>
you like to say something uh, for the people who like uh, maybe to vote for you? For me. Ooh, it's it's uh, it's hard because everybody asks me what what mm. can I say? Of course, I would say that vote a lot, but uh, I hope uh, people will vote because they love the song mm. and uh, are. Perfect.